is Joey McDonald, graphic designer and printmaker. Just about any other visual art that I can get into. I'm one of the directors of the Olio Artist and Workers Cooperative, which is a printmaking cooperative. I've been doing it for about four and a half, almost five years now. I've been screen printing for 12, 13 years. It's a pretty open format. It's a place where an artist can go and do something. And the whole reason for the space and the equipment is basically so artists have an increased capacity to delve into different mediums of art that can sometimes be prohibitive because they do require space and they do require equipment. In our case with screen printing, we have like a big washout booth in the back and that's probably the most important piece of equipment we have because without one, it's um, messy. Screen printing is a wonderful medium. It's really versatile. You can do just about anything because it's incredibly simple. Like the mechanics of it are, are basically just a screen, which can be just about anything. Typically it's just polyester and a frame and then just something to pass through it, which is typically water-based ink or solvent-based inks. The print process and the design process can be compartmentalized from one another. They can be separate or they can be kind of part and parcel. So you can start with the design and imagine the process that you're going to be going through when you're printing it and that can kind of inform the art that you're creating. It's a pretty open-ended medium and it's pretty old, it's pretty crude, it's pretty hands-on. What I seek to do is to have the substrate and the method you're going to be using when you're printing in mind completely as you're designing so you don't have to have art that is created verbatim. You can have the art inform the design and vice versa. The results that screen printing is capable of producing are pretty incredible, pretty, pretty unmistakable. It takes a certain commitment, it takes an amount of space, it takes a certain amount of resources, a certain amount of savvy, but what you get out of it, it's not easily matched. And the breadth of what you can do with it is not easily matched. There's a kind of a component of labor in it that I really appreciate. I think it kind of has a way of informing your design. Almost to, to kind of my detriment is I try and make it as challenging as possible to try and exploit the substrate and the end product as much as possible. Art has kind of found its way into, into my life and my practice through human methods and roads. And I find that almost all the art I do, without even noticing it, is just people. A lot of it's people I know, a lot of it's just people I wish I knew, a lot of it's just people that, you know, make me happy being a person. It's incredibly easy to become insulated doing art. In fact, there is a component of insulation in, in doing art, especially doing art intensely. So being able to be here and, and see other people working, being able to help them work, and, and indirectly having their work, you know, help mine in terms of how it informs me as an artist and is easily the best, kind of most healthy thing that I have access to. Sometimes when you lay the very first color down, you see what the interaction of that ink and that substrate looks like to you. And sometimes it's the last color where you see what it is you've made. So the, the point I really appreciate most, I think, are the points that I've really fully enjoyed and been really kind of like had these nice moments of, I guess, revelation through screen printing is when what comes out is, is different than you thought. What comes out kind of comes back at you. You think you're making a piece of art and instead you have this piece of art that's telling you what it is.